Hi, everyone. I'm Christine Caven, and I'm the Director of Communications at PS27 Ventures. Thank you for joining us today. We are here with Jim Stallings, who is the CEO of PS27. Hi, Christine. Hi, everybody. Thank you for joining in with us. So, Jim, I know we have some programs coming up this fall. I wanted to ask you, why is PS27 hosting a Veteran Founders Forum? Well, Christine, this is one that we've been waiting on. This is certainly one I've been waiting on for a very, very long time. We've been talking about creating a program and delivering a program just for veterans. I'm a veteran. I know quite a few veterans that are founders, have started companies, have gone on to be very successful leaders and CEOs. And this is an opportunity for us to reach out, to give back, to help mentor and coach the new wave of veterans that are coming out of the military, uh, recently left the military, and have skills that they can bring to entrepreneurship. That's what we do every day at PS27. We help entrepreneurs and founders create value for their shareholders. And we've always wanted to take some time out and design a very special program for veterans. And fortunately, in November, we're going to finally have our chance to work with uh, veterans and help them take their company to the very next level. So we're very excited about it. I'm personally excited about it, having gone through the process myself. So the program is coming up on November 2nd at Santa Fe College in Gainesville, Florida. Tell me what's unique about PS27 Veteran Founders Forum compared to other veteran programs in our area? Well, first we wanted to do it near Veterans Day, just to, to commemorate the, the holiday for our veterans in honor of what they've done and, and given to our, our country. Uh, the reason why we're doing it in Gainesville is it's near the university. One of the things we've discovered is the best place to find veterans, particularly those that are interested in being an entrepreneur and a founder, is on campus. Many are taking advantage of the GI Bill um, as, they, as they further their development and education and enter civilian life. Uh, many times they've settled uh, with their families. So we find the campus is a great place to uh, launch the program, identify with the veterans and find veterans. It's convenient for them to be a part of the academic environment there on campus, but also have a session with us at the PS27 Veterans Founders Forum and learn even more about how do you take the, the battlefield experience and the classroom experience into the entrepreneurial experience. So the reason why we're in Gainesville is because it's very close to a, a wonderful university, a very reputable school, and, and we find very quite a few veterans there. We're also doing it at Santa Fe uh, College because it's a, it's a convenient location. Uh, they've opened their doors to us. They've opened up the entire facility to us. Uh, there, there are other organizations within and around Santa Fe College that have embraced this idea. And uh, it's just very convenient. And, and again, we want to accommodate not just the veteran, uh, the founder and the CEO, but we also want to accommodate their family. Many times we find their spouse is a, is a co-founder or business partner. So we want to be near their families, make it convenient with them so that they can bring those people involved to the session. That's great. And I know that Santa Fe College is one of the top rated colleges for former veterans. So tell us a little bit more about um, who should attend this program and what will they learn? Yeah, this is a, the, a very exciting part of this. Um, we designed this primarily for veterans that have started a business. Uh, they're beyond the idea stage. They have a company. They've got some customers. They've got software or service business, and um, they're at a stage where they know they are onto something. They're growing. They may be making money. They've got a PL, they've got a small team, they've got customers within a region. And they've decided, okay, I want to grow my business now. This is more than just a little side hustle. This is now a way for me to make income. This can help me pay for my kids' college education. I can. I can grow this. And some may have even bigger ambitions. I'm going to build this into a national company. So I've got to go beyond my local market to the next larger market. And I need capital to do that. I either need venture capital or I need bank capital or I need some kind of a financing option. Those are the veterans we'd like to get in the room. 
because the center of the discussion is going to be how do you take new capital in? How do you acquire it? How do you get it? How do you go to a bank, the SBA, other organizations, and qualify for loans or qualify for venture capital? And then how do you deploy that capital? So we're going to have a finance class that's going to focus on that. One of the immediate options when you get new capital and, and a great use of it is to generate a marketing uh, program so that you can get more leads. So we're going to have a module focused on how to leverage digital marketing to drive more leads. The other thing we're going to do is have a, a program where the veterans are going to get a class on how to do enterprise sales. When you're in the military, you're not selling, <laughs> you're leading, you're convincing people you know, how, of difficult things that can be done, but you're not necessarily selling. So we're going to teach enterprise sales, a module on just that for veterans so that they can walk into a large company. They may be a small company and they want a large contract. They want to respond to an RFP. They may have to do a presentation to a committee or a council that's going to select a contractor for business. So we're going to do a module on how to do that sales class. So three modules, finance, marketing, and sales. So that's that's the unique program we have for the veterans. That's amazing. And, and it's, it's such a great thing to be able to give back to the community. I know there are going to be a list of folks who want to support this program and get involved. So can you tell us a little bit about how other people can, can join the program, get involved, and, and support the community in this program? Well, absolutely. Uh, the first need we have is we love to have companies, organizations that want to sponsor uh, this event. Uh, we we uh, have a foundation, the PS27 uh, Foundation, and if you go to the PS27 Foundation website or to the PS27 Ventures website, you'll find your way to a tab for sponsorship. So we'd love for companies to uh, open their hearts for the veterans and donate. The other thing is we have committed to the veterans as they exit the program, they successfully complete the modules, that we'd like to assign a mentor someone to meet with them, work with them for about six months to help them as they learn what to do, help them actually activate what they've learned. So we love for sales mentors, marketing mentors, finance mentors to go to the website and register to be a mentor. And the other thing, of course, is if you know of veterans that meet the criteria that we're describing, ask them to sign up. This is a nominal price to to get in, I think it's less than $100 to, to be a part of this. We're allowing them to bring uh, other members of their team so that this is really a team exercise. This is a working meeting. This is not a lecture hall where someone's gonna be on stage. We're asking them to bring their working materials, bring your QuickBook printouts, your PL, your cash flow statement, your marketing campaign, access to your website and social media. And we're gonna, we're gonna work on it during the day to get it better. They'll find themselves on their feet, um, talking to each other, interacting with the leader of the, of the workshop, but there will be an output. The goal is to have something improved by the end of the day in all those three areas. So it's fairly comprehensive. Um, I just want people to know there are lots of ways to get involved and uh, we welcome the support of the community. Well, there you have it. That's the PS27 Veteran Founders Forum coming to Santa Fe College in Gainesville on November 2nd, 2023. Entrepreneurship one-on-one -on -one for veterans. Uh, we're looking for folks to apply to attend veterans, active military, as well as spouses and professional service companies. You can get involved by visiting ps27foundation.org. Jim Stallings, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you, Christine. Good day, everybody. Bye.